And we begin tonight with politics as a special election took place today for the seat once held by longtime Republican Senator John Corson. News 19's Lauren Thomas has the results of today's voting. Democrats and four Republicans ran for the vacant Senate District 20 seat. Former state Democratic Party chair and longtime attorney Dick Harpulian came out on top, receiving more than 80 percent of the Democratic vote. I'm gratified uh, because it was it was a, a, an overwhelming endorsement of the message that the culture of corruption at the state house has to end. Um, and uh, I want to take that message to November, and then I want to take it to the state house. On the Republican side, two candidates will face each other in a runoff election. They are real estate attorney Benjamin Dunn and Reverend John Holler. Dunn walked away with 31 percent of the vote, while Holler received 25 percent. They hope that their campaign messages will resonate with voters over the next two weeks. My uh, campaign slogan is, there is a better way. And I truly believe that. Uh, I, I think that, that we can that we can do taxing and spending better in, in, in South Carolina. Um, I think that we can do term limits. I think that we can um, do a much better job of managing our, our infrastructure dollars so that we're actually you know, maintaining our roads and bridges. I want to try to improve the lives of all the citizens uh, in the district by helping uh, create an environment for businesses to operate uh, more effectively and efficiently and to reduce some of the government regulations that are holding us back. The vacant seat became open back in June when longtime Republican State Senator John Corson pleaded guilty to misconduct in office. He held that seat since 1984, but it's been empty since March of last year. With Tuesday's results now counted, the district is one step closer to representation. In Columbia, Lauren Thomas, News 19. WLTX. By the way, the runoff election for the Republican candidates will take place on Tuesday, August 28th. Whoever wins that nomination will face off against Harputlian in November. 